Now, we'll take the same previous example, but use a normally closed contact instead. So using a normally closed relay and having two different instructions in the PLC program, examine if closed, examine if open. A normally closed contact is normally closed and it provides the electrical continuity. And it opens when the contact is pressed. The physical contact is open. So now we're using a normally closed push button that's connected to an input module in PLC and a red light connected to the output module in PLC. So for a normally closed contact push button, if the push button is not pressed, the memory location connected to that push button within the module is showing one. As soon as the push button is pressed, the continuity changes and then the memory address changes its state to zero. There is no physical continuity. So now let's see what happens in the program when using two different instructions. Using XIC, remember XIC instruction is activated when the memory location is one. So if the push button is not pressed, the memory location is one because it's a normally closed push button. The current is flowing. As a result, the XIC instruction will be highlighted and the light will turn on without you pressing on the push button. So once the push button is pressed, the memory location is zero because we don't have a physical contact and the XIC is not activated anymore. So it works the opposite way as a normally open contact. Now having the same physical device, normally closed relay, with examine if open XIO instruction. Again, remember that XIO is activated when the memory location is zero. So if the push button is not pressed, the memory location is one, because remember, we're using a normally closed relay. As a result, the XIO instruction will not be highlighted and the light will not turn on. Once the push button is pressed, the memory changes to zero and the XIO is activated and the light will turn on. As you can see, although we're using the same physical device, normally closed contact, the way we program it in the software using ladder logic produces different outputs. So here's how the program will behave when having two different instructions while having the same contact. This to show you the difference that the program behaves when using different physical contact and how the ladder logics behave when using XIC, XIO with different normally open and normally closed contacts. So as a PLC programmer, you need to take into consideration what type of contact, what type of physical device you are using because that will determine what instruction you need to do in order to achieve what you're looking for.